Jack them up, boys. I have just been a crybaby today. I haven't ever, I haven't let it go yet, but on the way over here, I know now why that the devil fights me so hard to come here is because I always get filled up here. So why wouldn't he fight me if I'm going to leave here jacked up on Jesus? Woo! Praise the Lord. Um, my son and future daughter-in-law are building a house at our place. And um, I might as well just cry and get over with, huh? Woo! Anyway, um, the Lord teaches me through everyday things because I'm a hard head. I'm so hard-headed. Anyway, I was thinking yesterday, you know, and I've always said this, I'll take the blame for what I did, but I'm not taking the blame for something that I didn't do. And I was thinking that in my head, and the Lord said, Jesus did just that, didn't he? That'll suck the wind right out of you. It's because of the blood of Jesus that we're here today, that we can do what we do, that we can love people that are unlovable, that we can um, want to go where nobody else wants to go. That when we're so tired that we feel like our knuckles are scraped up from dragging them, that we still get up and go and love on them, right, Dave? It's because of the blood of Jesus. So, power in the blood. Y'all sing it with me and let's get happy. I'm not going to cry. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. The Lord, whoo, y'all sing good. Isn't that fun? You know, I was thinking I'm so grateful for home. Not just my home in Gordon and not just my home here at this church, but my home in the United States. Mm, grateful to have a place to call home. 
How many people this morning aren't grateful or aren't blessed enough to have a place to come and feel like you can kick your shoes off if you want to, that you can hug every neck in the place if you want to? That's good. That's so good. I believe that God gives us everything we need when we need it. And I needed y'all this morning. Just tired of crying. I don't like to cry. Thanks. See, I needed that. Dave told me, that, an 18-year-old boy told him I was pretty. Well, that, that's pretty sweet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the girls edified me all the way over here this morning. I think that's what got me started because I don't take that for granted. I don't, you know. Um, just a big old crybaby this morning. But I do love y'all. I do. I love y'all with my whole heart. Yes, absolutely, because I'm feeling overwhelmed with, when y'all love on me, I know those are God kisses. Because I know he loves me. He takes care of me. If I need money, he gives me money. If I need loving, he gives me loving. If I need to see my grandbabies, one of them will call me. You know, they got to spend seven days with me this past week. I got all loved up, but I just get drained out of it too fast. I get greedy for it. I want more, because more is more, right? <laughs> anyway, my song is Won't Let Go, and this morning I want you to know that no matter what you've done, no matter what's going on in your life, that he will never walk away from you. Once you receive Jesus as your Savior, he will never walk away from you. You can't shake him off. That's what he told me. He told me that, Dave. He said, you can't shake me off. I don't care how bad a mood you get in, how hard your life is, because I get, I get moody. I don't ask the kids. But I still have those days when I want to kick the dog. I was mad at Marty this morning because she wouldn't eat, and I needed her to eat so we could get gone. And uh, I'm human, just like y'all. I put my britches on one leg at a time, just like y'all do. But I know where my source is. And I know that he's waiting for me to ask him to come. He's right here. He's right here. He never lets go. He never lets go. So, won't let go. I'll put my shoes back on. It's like a storm that cuts a path. It breaks your will. It feels like 